Hello, hi, welcome to Side Roses. In today's video, we're going to discuss about how to create a bill in Odoo 19. So let's move on to the purchase module. As we just compared to the previous versions of Odoo, in Odoo 19, we can see that there is a slight change in the creation of the bill. So let's create a new RFQ where we just need to fill out the details of the vendor. I would like to choose ready mat as my vendor. Afterwards, I'll be choosing the product. So upon clicking on, on add a product, you can add the item to the um, product line. So here I would like to consider the equestric block screen with the custom variants white with one quantity and uh, two with black quantity. So uh, I mean two quantity as black. So once you click on confirm, you can see that the products will be added to the product line. Now we can confirm the order. So as we just confirm the order here, you can see that we don't have the option to create the bill. Instead, we have only the option to apply the bill. Now, let me receive the item and let's keep the item in the warehouse. And afterwards, let's move on to the uh, purchase order itself. And here you can see that I would like to print uh, the purchase order. So, let me click on print over here so that the PDF will be downloaded uh, behind uh, our uh, instance. So once it's been done, the next step is that we just need to create the bill. To create the bill in Odoo 19, we have the option to upload the bill. So let's move on to the upload bill so that it will be redirecting into the download option of your system. And uh, uh, here I would like to consider the bill. So let me uh, choose my bill frame here. Yes. Uh, and... As I just upload the bill, the bill will be uh, visible under the shadow. And here you can see that as you just open the bill here, you would be able to find the RFQ with its reference number. So for Odoo, it will be easy for the analyzing of which um, purchase order and uh, to which purchase order we are generating the bill. So as I just upload the bill here, you can see that we have the option to confirm the bill. So upon clicking on confirm, the bill will be moving from its draft state to the posted state. Now, upon clicking on pay, here we have the option to make the payment. So we'll be getting uh, the wizard and uh, we can click on create payment. And you can just go with the further process. And currently you can see that it is in in payment state. And after reconciliation only, the payment will be moving to the bank. Now let me move on to the RFQ uh, in the list view and here you have the option to view um, different uh, uh, RFQ so let me choose one of your RFQ as I just choose the RFQ from the list view also I don't have the option to create the uh, bill instead I have the option to uh, create a plot the bill and we can just follow the same process over uh, here also and as you just move on to the action button also we cannot find the creation of the bill in Odoo 19 now, let me choose multiple um, RFQ frame here and let me try to upload the bill uh, with different uh, vendors. So, when you try to upload uh, uh, the bill with different vendors, here you can see that we'll be getting a validation error. Like it will be saying that you can only upload a bill for a single vendor at a time. So, let me just go with the other option, uh, wood corner uh, with multiple RFQ and let's see whether it will be helping to upload the bill. So as you just move on with um, uh, multiple RFQs with a single vendor, Odoo will allow you to upload the bill and all the items from uh, different purchase uh, order will be uh, just uh, merged into a single bill. Uh, okay, so this is a change that you can find under Odoo 19 uh, in the creation of the bill. In, uh, and that's all for today. So if you find this video informative, please do like, share and subscribe our channel. If you want auto customization, auto implementation and auto tutorial videos, feel free to contact Cyprosis. As always, stay awesome and thank you for watching the video.